This is Lord Freezer Plan Super Monkey Ball. <laughs> what does this contraption do? I mean, you know. Oh, puppy. Off and on, thank you. Oh, 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 oh. oh no! I mean, hey, Freezer almost fell. Hey, hello, 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 oh, they start off with a hit. Okay. And we are here with Super Monkey Ball Banana Mania. We'll get to that. But first and foremost, there are a lot of options to play. Like, we have the regular story mode, which is cool. Um, if you like a challenge, if you like games with a challenge, if you played the original Monkey Ball series, you will like this. Um, definitely a challenge. Also... You have the party games mode and that might be my favorite mode because there are like i think about 12 games get off my stage get off my stage get off my stage you can go too you can go all three y'all can go get off my damn stage get off my stage we got billets, we got pool, we got soccer, we got a bunch of options Let's go. to play, Let's to, go. To, to mess around with the monkey ball and play. <laughs> Ooh, that's funny. Anywho, and you play a lot of different games, so the fun factor is there. My only, only concern with this game is why is there no online? You have, you have the formula to make a great party game for friends that are all over the world. You have a formula to make a great game for something new for Twitch for people to come together and play a, a good community game. And there is no online. That is no online mode. And to me, that's what that's what brings the grade down for me. Um, this, this thing about community game nights and things like that. Now, if you enjoy the games by yourself, if you have a family to play with, if you have people to play with, I still recommend getting this game. It is a great game. It's fun. No! Oh, yeah! Oh, no! 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 It's challenging. You have a bunch of different modes, things to unlock, different costumes unlock. You got people like, uh, like, uh, Kid to carry you from, uh, Yakuza. You got unlockables of Tails or Beats or Sonic from, um, people, from people all over the, um, Sega franchises. But ultimately, it comes down to what you want in your game. If you want to have fun, you got, and you have, and you're okay with no online, this definitely is a game for you. Maybe it'll be patched in later, but for me, that's what kind of dis disappoints me about this. Other than that, as a game by itself, this game is great. It's great fun. It's great for people. It's great for your uh, family. Great for your friends. In couch co-op mode, just the lack of online. So, what grade do I give this? I have to give it a B. I would give it an A, but that lack of online drops to the letter grade for me. It does what it needs to do as a party game. It does what it needs to do as a main game, as a one player game. It does what it, it, it feeds my itch to unlock stuff and it has it has challenges for people like that like to speed run, like to be completionist. But for me, what, bro what drops the grade down for me is the lack of online, that's all I really needed. I, I, I was preaching myself playing this with so many different people, and now I can't. Maybe in the future. So it's a pass, but it's a B. Super Monkey Ball, Banana Man. Hey, yo, I know they wild for this shit. Uh, hold on now, oh. Oh no, you fool, boy. Boy. Hey yo, really? Really, really now, Sega? Sega, what we doing here? Sega, where my, where my platform at? Hurry up! Ten! Y'all try to get me, Sega? Lord Jesus. 